Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Atelier Ferris and the Journey and the Mysterious Alchemist where we are currently in Southern Plains which I can't show you because you cannot enter your map when you're in the Atelier and what we have done is unlock the airdrops in the last episode so we can now enter these water based areas so uh, let's go let's do this pop it air drop time to go underwater so nice so nice we're gonna unlock a new area and last episode we went to the Etona version I'm sure which was uh, over here, uh, Atona Underground Lake. Today we are heading to the Time Lost Lake. Ooh, looks like a church in the background. Uh, it looks very normal. <laughs> it looks very normal game. Of course, we'll be picking up everything and fighting everything, Fish, even if we see a uh, rainbow pool really again. <laughs> oh man, I really <laughs> love this, this underwaterness. Hexagon Turtle. It's really weak. It's like very, very, very weak. Like very weak. <laughs> like I'm not entirely sure why it's so weak, but it's very, very weak. Easy win. Easy win. Maybe Atona was like his later game. Maybe. Treasure. Come to me. Okay, so we do have to make a couple of things. I'm gonna not head to the direction of that first. Maybe we're fighting one of Let's everything, begin, of course. Shall we? Black Apune. Yeah. Black up Black up You took too long for that. I'll murder you with a lightning this pistol. Is Booyah. <laughs> that was the experience easy. is a joke here, but place looks very pretty. Very pretty so far. No, don't get stuck on a, on a rock. Let's go this way. Ooh, big horns. Okay, hello, big horns. I'll fight you. I'll fight you. I'll fight you. Everyone, do your best. Bam, bam, para, bam, bam, para, bam, para, bam, bam. So I finally, after like literally 130 something episodes, got a right to get underwater, which is it's oh, I've been literally trying to do this since like I found out that there was a water part in the game. I was like, I want to go to the water, and I thought we needed the flying broom, and then I thought we needed the Let's flying ship, and then I was like, I don't know. So we googled in the early episode, and we found that, of yet? course, what we needed was the airdrop. And the reason we weren't getting the quest for the airdrop was simply Ooh, because we couldn't, because we had the quest for um, Liana, and the quest for Liana was causing the game almost to not allow other quests to activate until we'd actually finished the Lana's quest. Now, obviously, I did not know that. And there's obviously no way to know that, you know, when you're, when you're playing. So, I was running around the whole time trying to unlock, or the flu, in flu time, trying to unlock that quest. And I just wouldn't unlock, but now we know. But now we know. <laughs> just do side quests, and then every now and then just make your way back to flu time and potential. Ooh, isn't this a super, this was an elite. This flower wasn't, yeah, this flower was an elite, dude. I remember this flower being an elite very clearly. Um, in the heavenly eye horn sanctuary, this this uh, was, okay. I'm thinking. I'm assuming this one's much, much, much weaker. But that was an elite uh, jellyfish. Hello. Everyone, do your bam, 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 uh, Island fish. Oh, these are basic enemies. Yeah, these are basic. Interesting. It's kind of weird that the enemies in it, in Etona was so much stronger than here in the southern plains. Maybe a tone is like, <clears throat> excuse me, the final place you're supposed to go to after you've explored the other uh, water areas. You know, I don't know, because maybe you don't, you shouldn't have like the airship yet. So then you would have to run that uh, manually. And obviously, if you ran manually, then it would take longer, and you would uh, have to, you would first go to the close one, which would of course be the one where the water spot was, and your way back to Tony would stop in the Southern Plains. You know, so maybe. <laughs> Atona is like your final stop, so Atona is actually the hardest, the hardest version, which should be interesting. There's another one of those. Uh, the airdrop's fish. gonna run out! The airdrop's fine, first, don't worry about it. It's fine. I'm, I'm keeping these, but I think I, I, think I shouldn't. Oh, out. these ones look scary. She's drowning! Ooh, these guys look a little bit stronger. Black shells. Hello, black shells. They look a little bit stronger, but basically these look like the basic ones that you, or like these look like the elites that you fight. 
in other areas like the flower was definitely lit and this is definitely lit so now i'm like Prepare these look yourself. just like the elites but they're so much weaker maybe these are the original forms and then the elites come later and that's the strong form that i keep fighting so i've been fighting the strong elites the whole time i've been fighting and killing the strong elites so now all of a sudden that's a normal elite that doesn't look like a like a boss it doesn't look like the leviathan you know the leviathan he stuck out. He was very, um... Let's begin, shall we? He looked very intimidating. Looked very like, you know, he knew what he was doing as a, as a scary ass elite monster. Uh, boss monster. This, this guy looks just like a basic elite. Kind of like the elite we fight in the Traveler's Grove anyway. And if it's like the elite I find in Traveler's Grove, I will fight him. I will fight his Prepare butt. Now, I'm going to be honest with you guys. Prepare the one in Traveler's yourself. Grove is kind of strong. It's level 17. It kicks my butt. But uh, if it's anything like the super puny in the other water area, it should be fine, I think. I'm obviously going to pick this up. I do see a chest here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to fight the elite first before I open that chest because I'm scared that that elite is the super boss of this area. And then I get my butt handed to me and then I lose whatever's in that chest because that chest is probably going to have super rare items. It is a guardian, so it's not that strong. It's weak to lightning. I already know that. So this is the same enemy I fight um, in Traveler's Grove anyway. So... Oh wait, this one's super weak. This might be the one you fight by the wood golem statue, which is in the Liebenwald. Which is actually a much weaker version. And he's pretty much dead. Yeah, that was very easy. Not a problem. Very easy. So far, so good. We're having a good time in this underground section. Going very nice and very easy right now. Not having a hard time at all. We got another sword for Revy. Because, you know, let's just get infinite Revy Swords, the guy we never use. This is great game. You won't just give me a bow for Liana. Because that's all I really want. You'll keep giving me things, swords for Revy. There's another elite. Is it this guy? It is this guy. Huh? Sure. I just fought you in the... This was a normal enemy in Etona. Do you understand? So this area is obviously much easier than Etona. Like, obviously, Etona is the last underwater area you're supposed to go to because this is an elite, and this was a normal enemy encounter in Etona, and it wasn't even that strong. It's it's not even that strong. I mean, look at this. This is an easy fight. That's This is so weird. Everything's so much weaker here. I kind of feel like a little bit ripped off right now. Etona was much more scary, which means that the super boss here, we could potentially fight maybe if there's a super boss here i mean we didn't even know if there's a super boss yet yeah there was a super boss in eternal underground lake but we don't know if there's going to be a super boss in this area i think it'll be pretty easy to figure out i'm pretty sure he's going to stand out like like the other one did like the fish monster did but uh, you never know you never know so i see a chest here, kind, uh, the airdrop's gonna run out. kind of protected. There we go. Please let me another sword for Revy. Oh, it's some super armor. I have one of these armors, by the way. So, this is not like the super armor I got in the um in the Sky Island that I lost because I fought the fucking duet gods without the game. Telling me, warning me, or informing me that I was about to fight a fucking literal super boss. Okay, so I feel like we back where we started, which is kind of nice. So let's go this way. Beautiful. Let's make our way to the church, to the underwater church. I feel like this is this could be Revy's section of the map because remember Revy's looking for an ancient ruins type area that has. Um, well, I need to click on this because this one's all when it's on lonesome. You know what? I'll fight you too. Oh, is that a Rubenite? Ooh, I need a Rubenite. That would be nice. If it is a Rubenite, that would be great. I shouldn't have thought that. That was that was my bad. That was my bad. We must be careful that we don't fight any super bosses by accident because I don't want to lose this armor. You know what? I'm actually just going to immediately equip this armor to someone. I'm sure it's better than... Nope. 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 So you've got common shirt. I, I still don't understand how this level one common shirt is like the most powerful freaking equipment I've ever seen in this game. 
So Jostles really has mysterious played on. Mass produce, draw out power, and 116, 152. So memory sword, wisdom of the gods, and dagger. So everything goes down, but our MP goes up a little bit. But we don't want our MP up, so in other words, this is it's a pretty much useless item, so we don't actually mind losing that one. Hmm, interesting. Very interesting. We might just let that one go if we have to. I don't mind. I don't know what the sword is like for Revy because I'm not going to bother looking at it. Because I'm tired of getting swords for Revy. I feel it's stupid that Revy keeps getting weapons. Revy does not need weapons. Simply because I do not use Revy. But, uh, you know. Ah, ooh, there's our super boss. There's our super boss. That's what I meant. Like, I was pretty sure the super boss was going to stick out like a fucking sore thumb. And he stuck out like a sore thumb, guys. Let's begin, shall we? I need a super bomb that's going to kill all of these in one shot. What am I dealing with? Level 41 ghost. That's scary. That's scary. That's not someone to underestimate, guys. Level 41 ghost is dead. Okay, never mind. It's fine. Underestimate him as much as you want. It's fine. So let's not fight Mr. I'm a super soldier night guy standing there looking like a demon boss man that's gonna murder the f out of everybody treasure. try our best to avoid him if possible we will come here and get this thing though hey look. this is fuel hey look. it's useful for Dude, he looks he looks awesome he's like a he's like uh, a the going to run he's out. like a like a skeleton lord like a skeleton lord i want to fight this shadow but i'll wait until the edge of one time please don't drown first Oh man, I'm really enjoying these underwater areas just by the way. I'm really enjoying them. Is this the fight I fought just now that almost one shot at my entire team and almost went game over? This is an 879 quality fucking super Ori bomb, so this should murder everyone. And if it doesn't murder everyone, I'm gonna be annoyed. Yep, it murdered everyone. I'm not annoyed. Okay, what are you weak to, Mr. Book? Probably a bomb. This is alchemy. Apparently, if you throw a book with a bomb, the book will indeed be defeated. <laughs> so next time you guys don't want to write a test, just bomb your book, man. Just bomb your book. Gold and silver treasure. Okay, where are we at? We've got a big section of there to explore, but we do not want to go anywhere near. Wait, where? Oh, where am I? Okay, there. There he is. <laughs> I'm not going close. And I want to repeat, I'm not going close to Mr. Fucking Skeleton Soldier just standing there. Fucking all ominous, like I'm. Um, it's not happening. This is not happening. Okay. So he's obviously like guarding the church, which I think is fucking uh, awesome, by the way. But yeah, I'm not fighting. Let's try and get a slightly closer look. <gasps> no. 600 quality, 800 quality, fucking blowing up bomb of death. Bloody ambush me. Who do you think you are ambushing me? I had a heart attack. Please let me make Leona's ultimate bow, but you won't let me make the ultimate bow for some reason. It's it sucks. Yeah. So we want to go get a little bit of a closer look at this uh, big skeleton bro, but we want to be very careful not to accidentally encounter him as an encounter. So we want to just take a super slow, safe approach. The enemies here are much weaker, much weaker. So I'm hoping maybe, just maybe, we can use the uh, weak. Weak enemies here. Oh, the fact that the enemies are weaker to kill this dude. He looks awesome. Okay. So let's head on out of here. Let's go to. Um, I wish I could jump. That would make my life so much easier. Let's do this. L oh, we can't. Of course. That ma I mean, that makes sense. That makes sense. The map around here is all filled out. Yay. <laughs> this is a nice feeling. It is a nice feeling, Viz. You are correct. Do, 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 do. Now I'm wondering, at the Claude Prairie, there is a, a, a way out. And in Flusheim, there's a way out. Um, there by the Shanty Street, uh, where the ship where our ship is docked, there's a way into the water. And then in the Claude Prairie, there's a way in the water. But they kind of look like they both lead to the same area. If we look on the map here, I'll show you what I mean. 
So here we've got Santi Street and it leads to water area. And here we've got Claude Prairie and leads to water area. So I'm wondering to myself, do that lead to the same one or do they lead to different ones, you know? Because that'll be interesting because we had quite a few areas left to explore. Nine, if I remember correctly, uh, after we finished the last area. But the problem is we've only explored two areas and then we've got the holy area which is three and then let's say the lake area which is four that means there's still five other areas that according to this game i've never even seen or explored and that's what i want to know where are those areas you know what i'm saying so we had to put away all these items even though some there was a ton of level one sand and shit that we don't care about let's go fight the zombie lord so this one went a lot faster than the Eternal Underground Lake, but the Eternal Underground Lake had super strong enemies like the Here's Super Puny. This is a little trick to distinguish this? good materials. That took like Time forever to, to kill. So that's why that took long. So we're hoping that this we're hoping we can now, kill Skeleton Lord, obviously. What kind of materials will we find underwater? Watery kinds? Leafy kinds? Seaweed? Sashimi? I'm just saying, if you eat that whale, it's sashimi. Got some uh, calamari over there. Mm. Oh wait, that's jellyfish. You can't eat jellyfish. I don't know if you can eat jellyfish. I've heard you can't eat jellyfish, but I've also like Daddy, heard you can eat jellyfish. Right so. Not exactly sure how the jellyfish situation works. I I saw a documentary once where there's like in Japan, a uh, a boat that its entire job is to just go out into the ocean and kill jellyfish. That's that's a bit fucked up, but uh, you know I guess you, you gotta do what the man's gotta do what a man's gotta do. Here we go. Oh my god, it's the skeleton king. Oh, we're fighting the skeleton king. Let's go. Ah la 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 skeleton king. Where's that level 55? Dark Knight Addis. Dark Knight Addis thinks I'm scared of him. I ain't scared of no Okay, I'm a little bit scared. He's a big boy. He's a big boy, I tell you. This is alchemy. That did zero damage, game. Attack with an item. The music's good. Oh, I still need to fix the music. Shit. I mean the sound of the game. This whole time we're playing this game and the sound's been so bad, I haven't even noticed. Please do not one shot my entire body, please. This is alchemy. Please do not one shot my entire body. Please do not one shot my entire body, please. Chaos Blow. It. it didn't one shot my entire body! We have a chance! Oh, no money gets two turns. Of course he does. G gigantic Nova, yeah, that's gonna end well. Hey, it wasn't actually that bad. Arrow Assault. Yeah, gotta get an item. Hero Potion. Actually, no, it's spirit we've taught us. Nice. Arrow assault. Uh, you can use... Morale boost. I'm not sure if boosting is worth it, but... You know what? I made my decision. I'm gonna stick to it. Uh, so, he's weak to fire. So, we use a blitz call because that... Um, takes away some of his attack damage, which is really good. Keep using our 800 quality firebomb as much as possible. If we can get a full gauge and survive, we might be able to beat him. Okay, so Sophie is dead. I'm That's a problem. I mean, yeah, Sophie's dead. Dead man's call. Is that, did I read that correctly? Please do not summon zombies. Oh, you healed yourself. You can't heal yourself. That is cheating. Arrow starting hoping that I'm building like a possible. Oh, I should have used Sophie. Fuck. Dead man's call. Sophie's gonna die again. Crap. Sophie just keeps dying. I'm not gonna be able to get. Oh, she, she might survive. She might survive. Oh, she's cursed. So she's gonna. Yeah. That's. So she's, uh, Sophie can't be healed, which is kind of a big problem for us. Because she's cursed. I don't think I have a way to break that, unfortunately. Sophie, you are dead. And Gigantic Nova, I think Sophie and the uh, Jostle are dead. And Leona got broke! And... I mean, I think we did okay. We did much better than the Leviathan. 
let's be honest with you about it. The fucked my shit up. Mm, yeah. This guy's annoying. With these curses and shit. We only did like a thousand damage to him. Yeah. I don't understand this game's difficulty gaps, man. The thing is, is like I'm I feel I did grind for a little bit, so I know what I get out of grinds. And like every level gives me like one max HP and then like one MP and like five defense. Now the defense is great. No, not even five defense, like one defense. Now the defense and stuff is big. One defense matters in this game. But the one HP is not gonna stop me from dying when I take 120 freaking damage per hit and only have 130 max HP, you know what I'm saying? So that's like the only problem I'm having right now, but it's okay. Hey Kelt, um Why are you scared of women? Uh, about that. Well it's not much of a reason, but I've a younger sister and she loves to tease me. Every day, ever since we were children, it was prank after prank. Living in constant fear of when and where she'd pull off her next prank. Turn into Chinophobia before you even realized it? Yes, exactly. It's odd that the fear of one sister should extend to a fear of all women, but one can help one's fears. Of course, I've tried to overcome it, but I simply haven't been able to. So spending more time and energy trying to do so would be a waste. I've practically given up. That's, so that's why, Leona. I hope you won't take it personally if I react strangely to you. Thanks, I owe you. I think I skipped Leona's dialogue back in there, but because I was scratching my stomach. I'm gonna scratch my stomach because itchy, man. What was I supposed to do? One, two, three. Hmm, not bad, not bad. Hey, Angriff, what are you counting? Money, of course. See, have a look. Wow, that much? What are you going to buy with all that money? Not quite buy. It is to make my dream come true. I've got a huge dream. <gasps> so, Angriff, what's your dream? Well, if you want to know, you'll need to pay a special fee. Wow, ha, 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 wow. When I reach my goal amount, I'll tell you for free. You just gotta wait until then. Go ha 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 ha. What is your goal amount? Oh, what is it? Come on. He could have told me what it is. Angriff learned the skill knows for money. Increases damage against monsters that have a lot of money. Um, okay. <laughs> That's really random. But okay. So instead of unlock the honest bow and it kills my soul, but you know, what can you do? Okay, so we un we explored the underwater area in uh, Southern Plains, so we've got one more underwater area to go to. But we more than we like roughly halfway through this episode. I don't want to go do the next water area because I'm pretty sure the next water area going is going to be a much longer area. So what I'm actually going to do is go to Past Paradise and do Sophie side quest. Uh, start doing surface side quests because I would like to dedicate a whole episode uh, to the underwater okay, lake because I get the feeling the underwater lake is going to be a little bit of a different kind of situation you know much stronger That's enemies right. maybe bigger exploration area that, thing, so that, have to, that has to do something with the water spout remember so the water spout is obviously very really like very much a big deal abandoned village okay here we go why do we search for items in Liana's fucking dead hometown? Yeah, fairy. <laughs> Let's gather lots of stuff. Yep. <laughs> Those two seem to be having fun. Yes. Although they're perhaps a little too excited. <sighs> Teacher. There's a pretty rock over there! Oh, you're right! Let's go take a look! Hey! Don't run off like that! It's fine. You worry too much, Plakta. Oh, we're about to be attacked by some demon monster now, watch. Let's see... Yeah, this is good ore! I feel like something shook just now. Oh, oh my word, I was right! I was making a joke game. I think we should. I think we should leave them both there. What do you guys think? Does Sophie and Ferris deserve to die? And should Flakta and Leona just watch? What do you guys think? Save them. Okay, fine. I'll save them. 
What are we fighting, baby? Are we fighting something super good? Where am I? Oh, right. The ground suddenly started shaking and... Teacher! Oh my god. This isn't dramatic. a cave underground the ground gave way so we fell in no way we lost our bags <gasps> oh i've no alchemy What's items going to happen to us? you're gonna die don't give up Beerus. i'm sure we'll be fine liana and plakta will probably do something about this we just need to do what we can do what we can yeah Sorry, but could you look around here for an exit or something useful? I'd like to help look, but I can't with my leg like this. Teacher... Okay, I got it! This is... All because I said I wanted to do synthesis. No, this isn't the time to be thinking like that. I need to look around, for teacher's sake too! Okay. Sorry, Fisk, you look around this area for me? Sure, no problem. Big rock I can't get through. Ooh, maybe they're gonna find it. Let's break these rocks. We're gonna get an entirely new world underground to explore. Please, for the love of the Lord, don't do that. <laughs> this game's already too long. It's never ending. It's never ending. And as much as I'm enjoying, I do enjoy the game. It's no good. There's nothing around. If there were at least some plants, I could make something simple. Okay. Wait, was that a monster howling just now? Uh, I don't have any items. I'm a little scared. I just don't fight a monster. Oh, we can pick up. We can still pick up black sand. Maybe I can pick up these now. Nope. Okay. It looks possible to get out from here, but not while carrying teacher. But I can't just leave her behind. Oh, I guess I have to give up on this one out. Okay. I can't do jack shit. I'm pretty much stuck. Mm, talk to somebody. Mm. So, if it's good, look on this area for me. I already have. I've looked on this area. Uh, a, there's a scary woo monster that's gonna murder my soul. That's A. B, I cannot break these big rocks. C, I have to give up on that because I can't carry Sophie. D, I think we're going to die. I think Ferris is going to die, guys. Goodbye, Ferris, my old friend. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Aww. I've looked around everywhere. By the way, again. Okay, please do not be glitching out right now and screaming me from making progress because I would lose my actual mind. Am I losing LP? I better not be losing LP because you could actually then just like get stuck in this area and go game over. What the fuck is happening? I can't get into my menu. I can't do shit. So I've still got my uh, my mining rod. Oh! 
เออเออนึกฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมฮึมโอเค well if you guys know what that means to our good friend Google Atlee first um Sophie and first stock and cave This is weird. Hmm. Where should I go next? Apparently, apparently, this is supposed to come up another exclamation mark, but I haven't seen one. Have you guys seen one? I haven't seen another exclamation mark. The the guy the internet just says hug the wall and spam X. So we're gonna hug the wall and spam X. But this is stupid. This is not. I do not like this type of. Design, I think it's uh, as you all know, pretty bad. Have like a set thing on what to do, please. Another exclamation mark! I haven't seen another exclamation mark, but I will hug this wall like a crazy person and spam X. This is fast trading. Wait, uh, I can't get into my menu. I can't get into my menu. There we go. I was gonna say I can't get into my menu because my sound's off and it says listen for a sound. That's why I'm, I can't hear it. Welcome back. How'd it go? It's no good. I found what looks like an exit, but oh, really? Then just leave me behind and. <sighs> I thought you'd say that. I won't. I can't just leave you behind. Also, it seems like there are monsters nearby. Even if I went off alone, it would probably be the end of me. 
Just don't fight the monsters. Also, both of you have both your bags. I don't understand See? what the problem is. Then I guess we just have to trust in Pacta and Liana. And wait. You have nothing to worry about. Liana would never let something happen to Ferris. Ever. Ever. If something happened to Ferris, I'm pretty sure Liana could single-handedly and destroy the entirety of uh, this in-game world. Is this where they commit Sudoku together? Are you hungry too? I thought that was my stomach for a second. Yeah. <laughs> Oops. Miss Sophie? You look kind of pale. Huh? Really? She looks fine to me. She's got rosy cheeks and everything. What? Become medicine! Become medicine! Was that a voice just now? What is this? Want to become medicine! Want to help her! You can't set yourself first and then pretend. Medicine? Who's there? Where are you? First, you're lit. You are literally voicing other things. I need to get into my main. <laughs> I need to. Oh my god. Oh oh my god. The game's so zoomed in. Ah, uh, game's too zoomed in. Zoom out. I can't see like this. Oh my god. Why is it so zoomed? Okay, so something wants to become medicine. I'm assuming it's one of these. Why is the game super zoomed? Oh, here we go. There it is! It was at a place like this? If I recall, this plant has medicinal effects. That voice I heard, though, was that you? I want to become medicine. I want to help her. Will you fulfill my wish? Oh my god, it's so cute! Yeah, I'll fulfill your wish. I'll take good care of you. Thank you. Thank you too. Oh my god, it's so cute. <laughs> ah, I can't handle this cuteness. It's done. It was a little slapdash, but this should help, teacher. Here, drink this. Yeah, thank you. Okay, now you just need a little rest. I'll get some sleep too. Bottle four. To protect from the monsters before you do that. Beerus! Beerus! Uh, Miss Sophie! I can't eat anymore! Beerus! Wake up! Miss Sophie! Uh, is it okay for you to be walking around? Yeah, I'm all better. Thanks to the medicine you made. Also, there's nothing else to worry about now. We found your backpack, Ferris. It didn't seem like anything was missing. You're speaking to Sophie, but you're saying Ferris. Ferris, you're awake! I'm glad. I'm so glad. Leah! Plakta! They showed up to help a little while ago. But you were fast asleep, so... It seemed you had lost your backpack, so we went to look for it in the meantime. I'm very sorry. The path to get here was more complicated than anticipated. So, it took a while to come help. That's okay. Thank you very much, Plakta. You too, Leah. No problem. Anyway, let's go back to the Atlier. I'm sure you're still tired, so you should rest in bed. Okay. Yes, that would be best. We need to properly treat Sophie's wound as well. <gasps> Sophie, no. Yeah, you're right. Let's go, Furious. That voice. Was that all just a dream? Furious, what's wrong? Oh, sorry. 
It's nothing. I'll be right there. So first you'll be able to hear the materials, wishes or whatever. So I should be able to get like super materials or something. I can hear a voice. Oh no! <laughs> you can't just this drop a dude on my butt. Okay, let's go to our curse book. Into the ruins. Let's go to the ancient ruins. Okay, that's that. And then I'm going to play. Do we finish it? Do we finish all Sophie's quests? Send source of place. I think we finished all the quests. Okay, that would be interesting if, that, if we've done with all the with the with Sophie's quest sideline. Maybe then we can unlock Sophie's rod and we can make Sophie's rod, which I think Ferris can also equip, which would be great because then Ferris can get a better weapon. <gasps> yes, yes. Right. Here, this is my way of saying thanks. Give me that most ultimate weapon in the game. You know, because you made medicine for me back when we fell. Ultimate weapon. <sighs> You don't need to thank me for that. Just give me an ultimate weapon for first. <laughs> There's no need to hold back. You should accept it. Oh, your sparkly eyes. Okay, I got a it. A crimson stone. Okay. Ugh. Is that all? By the way, Furious, how did you find the ingredients for that medicine? That medicine spoke to me. It didn't look like there were any useful plants growing down there. I suddenly heard a voice saying, I want to become medicine. Then I found it where the voice was coming from. Wait, that's... Sorry, Furious. I need to check something. This ore. Do you know what it's saying? Huh? Hmm. I want to become armor. Strong armor that can protect people. I heard something just now. Um, it said it wants to become armor? Then what about this? I want to become clothes. Cute, dazzling, and beautiful clothes. Okay, the problem is... The problem is, when the ingredients talk, the character's mouths move. When the flower spoke, Ferris's mouth moved. And when this water spoke, Sophie's mouth moved, so I'm getting confused. It wants to become clothes. That's what I heard, at least. Uh, they're both right. You did it, Beerus. You can hear the voices of materials now. Give me a bonus that means I can make the best alchemy uh, items. These are the voices of materials? Yeah, most likely. Congratulations, Beerus. It seems you really do have natural talent. It's extremely rare to hear actual voices from materials. You should be proud of such power and aim to become an even greater alchemist. Mm, okay. <laughs> it's all so sudden. So I still don't completely get it. But I understand. If these are the voices of materials... Then that plant really did want to help teacher. It's because of you that she was saved. Thank you. No, but you murdered the plant to make the medicine. You see, it comes to stop. I thought of a new item. What? Mm, I can make a new item a now. A shat's flame. That sounds horrible. I'm really. It's a horrible name, game. Is there? Okay. So we make a shat's flame. Hello. I'm Yeah about the naming on that <laughs> Okay sweet, let's go check out what a shat's flame. It looks like a bomb. Maybe it's the What's best firebomb in the game. What's it called? A shat's flame. Shat's flame. Really awkward name. Shat's flame. Shat's flame. We're looking for a shat's flame. Sh -sh 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 shat's flame. Shat's flame. 
Chest flame. What material what should I use? I don't know what, what it is. Sort by use? quality. Boop, boop. Uh, not using super high quality uh, ace class diamond ore for this. I'm sorry. We'll use light. Fine chase chest. Fine chase chest. Is now time to start the synthesis material set. Material set. What do you mean over. fine treasure chest? Explain to me the words. Even. What fine treasure chest is cool looking at? Shat's flame. It's a freaking pocket watch. I made it. It's an amazing they can find hidden treasures. <gasps> By equipping the shat's flame, you can discover hidden treasure chests. It reacts when you're near a hidden treasure chest and it will appear when you get even closer. Hidden treasure chests contain rare items, so you should look for them. What? With this I can find mines of gold and silver. Hee <laughs> hee, the day I become super rich is almost here. Uh, Ferris, just FYI. We have way too much money already. I don't know if you know this. Flame of origin. Uh, but we got way too much. Also, if I give you that, that means I need to unequip something. I guess the pickaxe can go. Because I never used the pickaxe. Pretty much. We have 242,000 gold. What is first talking about? I've got so much money, I actually don't even know what to do with all the money. Because I, I assume we finished with Sophie's quest line. So, what do we have? Into the Ruins, which is Rain's quest line. And then we have Wall of Switches, Edel's quest line. And then we have Play with Pilmeria, which is our other quest line. We try to unlock Angriff and Kyle's quest line, but it's going hard. We did Liana's quest line, but even though I did Liana's quest line, the game is like, no. You still can't get Liana's spear. And I'm like, just give me Liana's freaking... I want Liana's bow already, game. I've got to stop helping Leah. I know if I can get some powerful metal and metal-like string, I think I could make a perfect bow for Leah. I can't believe how not... Okay, this is like, I think I still need to do this, and I think I still need to do this. What's this? We find out the island in the sky. First, I've got to make... First, I'm gonna make a steady stop. I'll start by preparing a strong metal and a multi purpose neutralizer. So, I'm assuming I need to make a strong metal. Wow. What to make? Is there a strong metal in this game that I have not yet made? Is that possible? Like, we've got Sylvia, Gold, Iset, and Ignat. Obviously, there's a stronger metal, but we need to make a stronger metal first. How to do that, I'm not entirely sure. So, what is this? Oh, that's the wing thing. I don't know, man. I just don't know. Rubenite. We should make a Rubenite because we need one for the... What's call it? Yeah, I'll use 999 quality. It's fine. I'll use 999 quality ones. It's fine. Make the most high quality Rubenite in the history of the world. Aha! I want to become delicious sweets. I want to satisfy someone who's hungry. Okay, but. Okay, I got it. Then I'll turn you into sweets. I want to become a magnificent bomb. I may be plain, but I want to show off with a big bang. Then you'll become a bomb. <laughs> I'm totally used to hearing the voices of materials now. But why did I suddenly start hearing them? It's kind of strange. I should ask my seniors about things like this. I'll go talk to teacher. This game never ends. This game never ends. It never ends. It never ends. I've decided it's a never ending game. Every time you finish a quest, they give you more quests. Every time you finish the quest, they give you more quests. For now, that's going to be another episode of At Your First. Thank you all very much for watching. What if you guys you enjoyed mean? it, please all be sure to hit that like button. It helps out a lot. Subscribe for more At Your First in the future. <laughs> and um, I will see you on the next episode when we will speak to our teacher once again. And find out why we can suddenly hear the voices of the materials. As well as use this new item we got. The Shat's Flame. I hate the name of it, but it's a cool item. Hidden treasures. Hidden around the world going to be very interesting to check that out see if there's anything we can find that we can it says rare material so i'm assuming it's going to be very good for us and then last but not least we will then have to head to the underwater lake in the next episode so we will see how the speaking with sophie goes and then probably head to the underwater lake in the next episode now thank you very much for watching i appreciate the support i'll see you all next time with more at Ferris.